Well, fajita turnovers are something I've come up with. Instead of using a tortilla or whole wheat tortilla, I'm making my own crust. It's sort of like a whole wheat pie dough. So a cup and a quarter of all purpose, and one cup of the whole wheat flour. And then I need to add one and a half teaspoons of salt. Half a cup of cold butter. And I'll cut it into the flour in big chunky pieces. And I'll work it in quite quickly just to make sure it's really cold. And I'll just blend this in with my fingers. And it's fine if there are a few big hunks. There we go. Look at that. Still visible pieces of butter. Now for the liquid, a third of a cup of ice cold water. An egg right from the fridge. And to promote flakiness and tenderness at the same time, I add a tablespoon of white vinegar. Sprinkle well in the center, add it all in at once. And I stir just so that the moisture is slightly absorbed. Now bring the dough together with my hands. So I mix just until all the dough is evenly textured. I don't want to exercise it too much. There we go. And you can see the whole wheat flour in there. It really comes out when you add the liquid. But now I have to let the dough rest for a little while and letting the proteins within the flour, that's within the whole wheat particularly, relax so that it rolls out without shrinking back on me. Just like when you order in a restaurant, you can do beef, you could do pork, you could do chicken. So I'm going for ground chicken for the fajita filling. Oil. And three quarters of a pound of ground chicken. And while that starts to cook, I'll add the spices in. A teaspoon each of ground cumin and coriander. and a teaspoon of chili powder. And I know Michael likes a little spice, so I think I'll throw in some chili flakes too. All that sautés, and I'll get a little bit of onion and pepper. Set that aside to cool. And what I'll do is turn this up to almost its hottest setting. Add a touch more oil. And the idea is just to quickly cook the onion and pepper. If it browns a little bit, that's just fine. I'll just let this go for a second and I'll get the garlic ready. Oh, Maureen's garlic is something else. It's a little milder and a little sweeter. And these cloves are so huge. Just stir for a moment. And mix that in with the chicken. Oh, it's fajita time. Okay, time to check on the pie dough. Wasted. I will roll them again and do another round of turnovers. So I'll start with four. The whole 
egg, a little cold water. Using a little egg with a bit of water helps the pastry stick together. Of course, about a third of a cup of filling in each. Brush the outside. the edges. Just like making a traditional turnover, just use a fork. I'll use the same egg wash to brush the tops of the turnovers. This helps promote a nice even browning and adds a, a little shine to the top of the turnovers. Okay, so it takes about 25 to 30 minutes in a 375 oven. I've got another few to make. And then after these bake and cool, I'll chill them down and probably have to try and hide them from Michael before I pack them up for our picnic. <laughs>